into November everyone. Whoop whoop. It's finally, finally here. I think we've been talking about it for like or I have for the longest time ever and as much as I love autumn and like pumpkin seasons and things like that I am just so happy it is finally the first of November and I am praying that I'm going to get this video edited and uploaded this evening for you so hopefully you'll be seeing this on the same day that I'm filming it which is really really exciting but obviously it means it's literally Christmas time now like it is literally Christmas I mean the only C word you're going to hear on this channel is Christmas we're not going to talk about the other one this is going to be a place for you to come and just escape from all the craziness that's going on and really just get excited for Christmas with me so without further ado make sure you've got your hot drinks your cold drinks your mulled wine your glass of wine whatever beverage it is that you like you snuggled up on the sofa and let's get into this massive home sense primark and a couple of other little bits and pieces for christmas haul oh. okay let me put this down because it oh it's still super super hot so where am i going to start with i think we're going to start with just some little bits from home bargains so i literally nipped in to get these which are like ornament hooks you get 300 of them in this massive pack for a pound but i find the little like string that come with most baubles are really quite difficult to get on and get off of the tree but the actual hooks are so easy and they kind of like clip into the tree if that makes sense so you can kind of position them a bit better than with string so if you haven't already um i would really really do recommend these you can get them on amazon online as well um but they're super super handy and then i also picked up these command hooks so they're not the tiny ones that you do with the like fairy lights with but they're kind of like this size so you get six in a pack and I just thought they're going to be really easy and because they're clear to put on our banister to hold the stockings and the stars that I got from. I think I got the stockings from Home Bargains and maybe even the stars from Home Bargains. I definitely got the stars from Home Bargains. I don't know if I got the stockings from B&M. I don't know. They're probably in one of my other hauls. Um, but yeah, I thought these would be really good to kind of like discreetly hide the hook as well, at, you know, whilst it's on the stairs. So very good value i think these are only like three pound fifty from b m but they're also very similar priced on amazon as well but i just picked them up whilst i was there rather than waiting for delivery okay and then next up i went to tesco so basically after christmas last year tesco's had all of their like wrapping paper gift bags gift tags you name it anything like that they had on like massively reduced because christmas was over um, and we stocked up on loads and loads of rolls of wrapping paper which were like white with little reindeers on they were kind of like gold and red really really nice it doesn't go with my Christmas theme in the living room but hey ho it's fine the only thing we couldn't get was gift tags gift bags for that same wrapping paper so I actually went to Tesco's and I actually got the matching gift bags which I thought are super super cute so they've got like the little reindeer on, gold, white, exactly the same as last year. Say so Merry Christmas on, they're so cute. So I've got six of these. I didn't know how many I actually needed. Um, I probably should have done with some more, but they're quite big sized. So I think they'll fit quite a lot of different presents in as well. And then I also picked up the matching gift tag. So they are round whereas last year they were like rectangle but there's the same like print on them so they'll go perfectly fine with the paper that we have um obviously they've got the white on the little reindeer and they say merry christmas so i got a couple of those and then to finish it off i just got some gold ribbon and some gold bows got quite a few different packs of these because i know that i run out quite quickly um but i just thought it's best to have them now i can start decorating at my own time own leisure and i love putting ri ribbons and bows on presents like that's my favorite thing to do okay we're now gonna go to the home sense haul of the video and i'm so excited for this so those little bits that i've bought, um, shown you already are just basically like you must have at christmas so like 
things to stick things on with like your command hooks and your little um, decoration hooks and then your essentials for gift wrapping but now another essential is your Christmas crackers I mean is it really Christmas if you don't have Christmas crackers whilst you're around the table I don't think so um, these ones are Tom Smith ones you get 12 family crackers and they're in like a white and like a dark grey like a charcoal grey um, but I thought they were really really cute it obviously shows you on the back what kind of prizes you get which with any crackers unless you do them yourself you don't obviously get amazing crackers but these were only 4 99 amazing um i was looking in some in MS the other day as well and they were a lot more expensive and the prizes actually weren't as good like you actually get a jigsaw the little fish that flips over a frog all sorts in this one so yeah got to be an essential then i also picked up two of these now they are so so cute they're just white um little houses basically but they light up so if i take the little thing out here we go our house is all lit up looking nice and cozy i thought this was so cute for christmas like you could have one like either side of your tv or sat on window sills or you know things like that and it was only 3 99 so i got two of them um but yeah like they are just so cute and for 3 99 from home sense i thought that was an absolute bargain like you can go to garden centers and see things very similar to this and they're a lot more expensive so home sense is definitely a place for these and I actually saw them as I was queuing outside um, to get in they were like displayed in the window and they looked so so good I was just thinking oh god how much are they going to be and there were literally only two left as I walked past them so I thought $3.99 you're coming home with me they have also got these beanies limited edition like Christmas scents I suppose coffees in at the moment for $1.99 um, so I got the mulled wine the mince pie and the cherry bakewell now I can confirm the cherry bakewell tastes very nice but the mince pie not so much I haven't tried the mulled wine one yet but I will do and I'll report back on my Instagram story if you're interested um, but yeah Cherry Bakewell one is very nice. Not too sure about the mince pie one. I might have to give that to someone else who likes it. But when you open the lids, like the scents of them are so strong, like you can tell what they are straight away. But in the coffee, the mince pie one definitely doesn't taste like mince pie. It's a bit strange. Um, but you might like it. Um, but only for one ninety nine. I thought they were absolute bargains, and they just look quite cute on the side in the kitchen. And did you even go to Home Sense if you didn't bring back any candles? I don't think so. And in fact, I actually got three. So, you know. Um, this one being the biggest of them all and it is absolutely gorgeous. And look at the lid. Like how amazing is that? It's obviously very Christmassy. So this one is called White Christmas and it's by DW Home, which I love all of their candles, like incredible. And it smells very, very Christmassy. Um, on the lid, it kind of gives you a bit of a description. So it says peppermint snow and regal evergreen glimmer with winter citrus and mistletoe hand poured. Um, but it just smells amazing i absolutely love it and i just thought the lid of it was super super cute with it being like the jesus scene i don't know what it's called i went to catholic school as well anyway <laughs> um but yeah i thought that was really really nice and this will probably sit really nice on my little unit at the bottom of the stairs um, where I currently I have my pumpkin and my home bargains candle and diffuser so I just need a diffuser now that's very similar to this kind of tones like the whites with a bit of gold and maybe a little bit of oaky wood effect um, but for this massive candle it was only $7.99 so an absolute bargain then I also got this one as well which is actually called Christmas Morning um, and it actually smells like a coffee shop at Christmas time if that makes any sense oh, it 
smells so so good again this is from a dw home and what does it say it doesn't say the scent of this one but i'm telling you it smells like a coffee shop at christmas it's so good so so cute um obviously it comes with the black lid it's got the red writing on and it's kind of like a creamy toned candle and this one was only 2 dollars it's a lot smaller than the 7 dollars candle um but it smells so so good it might be really nice just next to the kettle like that and in the morning smells so so nice and then I also got another DW home candle and this and this one is called white pine and honestly it smells amazing it's got a really cute red tartan lid and obviously the rest of it is white and black again this one was $2.99 oh, it smells so good if anyone uses like the star drops pine disinfectant um, spray or the astonish pine or even if you use the Febreze, is it the Febreze or Airwick Frosted Pine Spray, like room spray? I'm obsessed with anything pine at this time of year when it gets to Christmas. So a Frosted Pine smelling at candle is just dreams. So I don't know where I'm going to light this one yet, but I'm sure I'll find a place. Just need a sip of my tea, guys. Feel like i end up talking at like 100 miles an hour because i don't want to make the video super super long and if you're bored of one of the items i don't want to talk about it for too long but then i just get lost in the sense of candles sometimes um right so that is all from home sense i didn't actually get a lot i mainly went in for coffee syrups so like the sugar-free ones but they didn't have any i even went into a tk max as well and they also didn't have any so i'm gonna have to order them offline somewhere um so if you know where to find really nice sugar-free coffee syrups online then please let me know in the comments below but we're now going to go into primark which i'm very excited to show you what i got i didn't get an awful lot like i didn't go crazy um but i picked up this really really cute jumper it's kind of got like um cut out um it's called embroidery no just like got some holes in it to make it look a bit of a fancy pattern it's just in like a creamy color creamy off-white color it's really nice it's not the itchy kind it was 10 pounds and it's made it's from the primarks care range so it's made from recycled materials which I thought was really good and I like them that where they don't have like the elasticated bit and the bottoms of them um, but the arms seem to be like quite oversized and then they have a little bit of elasticated around the wrist bit so that's really really good um, I got it in a XL just so that it'd be super baggy but yeah I love this one like you can never have enough jumpers at this time of year and I'm just obsessed with like the creamy white vibes if you haven't like taken any notice and yeah so I just thought I'd add another one to my collection whilst I was in Primark okay next up so I don't know if you've seen but Primark have really upped their game when it comes to loungewear especially Christmas loungewear okay so what I'm about to show you comes in this colour and also in red it is the softest fabric ever super cozy it's the kind of at like outfit that you'd be able to wear in the house chilling but i also wouldn't be bothered about leaving the house in it either so like that's perfect so these are ooh, these are the trousers they've got like reindeers stars christmas trees like i said it's in the black and white theme they've got a cuffed around the ankle and elasticated waist so excited so excited for these like how gorgeous are they so festive so christmasy 
and they're also from the Primark Cares range so again using recycled materials to make them but they're so soft and so cosy I can't wait to wear them and you could even wear these but with like a black hoodie um, or just a long black top if you wanted to as well so you know but I bought the hoodie to go with it so it's got a hood and it's in exactly the same pattern it's got a fake whatever this is called what's that called I don't know I can't remember I'm too excited um it just feels so warm and cozy honestly I'm so excited that I got my hands on it I'm pretty sure they were both ten pounds let me just double check yeah they were both ten pounds each so twenty pounds for a really cute Christmassy lounge set and I just think obviously I'm gonna be working from home still so I'd even be able to wear this on my little zoom calls and be like hey guys it's Christmas um so yeah I am so excited about this I'm actually really 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 pleased I went into Primark to pick this up because it's just so festive. I was going to get it in the red but then I was kind of like red's not really my colour in terms of clothing. I know it's Christmas but I really liked the black and I thought I could always wear red lipstick with it if I wanted to feel extra Christmassy that day. So yeah, absolutely love it. And for reference, I got them both in a size large, which is 14 to 16, which I think the top should still be quite oversized. It seems quite a big oversized look to it anyway. Um, and because they didn't have any mediums in the trousers, but I thought with leggings you can tend to get away with it because they're quite stretchy in anyway so I don't know we'll see I'll make it work anyway and I also picked up these which are so so cute and cozy and Christmas vibes just a two pack of cozy socks and they're in grey with white on it was only two pound for the two pairs but like is it even winter or approaching Christmas if you don't get some of these like my feet are always cold so I have to make sure I keep my feet nice and nice and warm and these do the trick. Like my grandma and my nana always used to swear by them and used to buy me them all the time so it reminds me of them and they're right. You need a pair of cosy socks to keep your feet warm at this time of year. Okay so now basically the main event and the reason why I went into Primark in the first place which is... The one and only Grinch pyjamas. Like, is it Christmas if you haven't got your Grinch pyjamas on? I don't think so. And what does this say on it? Naughty is the new, the new nice and it's Grinch stealing the Christmas tree. Love it. Absolutely love it. I got it in the biggest size possible which was XL and that's an 18 to 20 how much was you the top was only six pounds very very nice very festive um the trousers are just the cutest things you've ever ever seen honestly like look at them again they've got cuffed bottoms and a cuffed waist and these were eight pounds which I thought was quite a bargain and I just think they're gonna look super cute together when it gets to Christmas time with you oh I'm just I'm just so excited to be wearing Christmas pajamas with the Grinch on I'm so excited but yeah I got the XL in the pajama top because can't stand nothing more than a pajama top being too tight and like not being able to feel like you can move especially at Christmas time when you just sat there eating all the chocolates so you know um yeah I love these let me know in the comments below if you like the, the Grinch and if you would wear these pajamas because I think we all need a pair all I'm saying 
And finally, my loves, I actually got some Grinch trainer socks, basically, to wear with my Grinch pyjamas. Um, it comes in a pack of three. This one makes me laugh because it says, rest in Grinch face. How cute is that? Um, the second pair look like this, with the Grinch faces all over it. And the third pair... I have to show you from the back it's just a big face of the Grinch saying the Grinch on and they were £2.50 for three pairs but I just thought how cute and they'll go really really nicely with my new pyjamas so so excited I might even have to wear them tonight it's not too early you know November's basically a write off so that means it's only Christmas now right I mean, I've already seen loads of people around here with their Christmas trees and Christmas lights out and I'm like, this is why I live around here because everybody's on the same wavelength as Faye, you know what I mean? But anyway, my loves, that is going to go ahead and conclude the video for today. I hope you enjoyed my little haul of Christmas shopping, like gift wrapping, Christmas crackers, decorations, candles. And obviously the Primark is absolute essentials. And by the way, this is from Home Bargains. I was on the mad hunt for it. So you'll have seen from my Home Bargains haul that I got the ones that say Merry and Bright. They're absolutely gorgeous, but I really wanted the gingerbread ones to go with my collection. So if you're looking for the perfect Christmas mug, then you need to get yourself to Home Bargains because they have some amazing ones. But anyway, as I said, that's going to go ahead and conclude the video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Like I said, this is going to be your place to escape for even if it's just 15 minutes of the day and just escape all the craziness that's going on and get excited for Christmas with me. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you've enjoyed it, give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.